Hey everybody, I'm Dr. Angie Anderson and I am excited to be bringing to you on Tuesdays as much as possible a Tapping Tuesday series. So I've been thinking about this for some time now and as I get ready to gear up on this Tapping Tuesday opportunity for us all, I have decided I wanted to do an introduction with you. So I want to take a moment just to introduce what is tapping. Tapping comes from emotional freedom technique and it was originally designed by Gary Craig, who is not the typical psychological founding father. He was actually an engineer. He learned about EMDR and decided that that was just a little too complicated. So he brought and introduced this tapping series that pretty much anybody can do. I got certified in it probably maybe 10, 15 years ago. So I've been tapping a long time and I've been putting my own angieism in it and been bringing some tapping yoga, which we're getting ready to bring back at Grace Yoga soon. And um, I also have a tapping yoga on the YouTube uh, channel, Dr. Angie Anderson there. So you can find out more about the tapping yoga if you're interested. But I would like to take a moment to invite you to join me each and every Tuesday to uh, tap on various issues like chronic pain or manifestation or anything that you feel like you might need to tap on. People tap on all kinds of things like nightmares or anxiety for emotional regulation if they're getting ready to take a test or go into an interview or things like that. But before we do tapping, I feel like we need to go through a series of it to kind of explain what it is. Tapping the emotional freedom technique basically looks at when we've had something distressing or traumatizing from either back all the way to childhood or for those that believe in past lives and things like that, it can help us recharge and find some emotional regulation. So tapping doesn't cure the problem. It does help us be able to find an energy space where we're better able to deal with those problems when we're faced with it. So we have emotional regulation so that we can um, approach problems in a more logical way. So if you would like to, uh, well, let's do, let's go back. I'm going to come back to that. So let's go and do a tapping series so that you can at least kind of understand what we're going to be doing each and every Tuesday. So I'm not going to necessarily be tapping on a phrase or anything that specifically. So if you're watching with me now, I would like for you to take a moment to just think about what's something that's bothering you. Uh, maybe emotionally, are you stressed out about something? Do you have something coming up that is a little bit nerve wracking for you? Or are you at the end of the day dealing with some kind of um, pain issue? Like do you have jaw tension? Are you having tension in your shoulders? Do you have a headache? Things like that. So I want to invite you to think about right here, right now, what are you experiencing? And as we tap, I want you to think about that. So usually when I'm doing this in a session, I would invite you to rate that, whatever that is for you on a scale of one to 10. One is mm, not so bad. 10 is, oh, holy moly, this is off the charts. So think about where you would put that right here, right now on one to 10, because I'm gonna ask you to re-rate that at the end. So in your space, I want to invite you to just find a comfortable seat. You can do tapping, lying down, or you can do it standing up. So however you're comfortable right now, I want you to find that space for yourself and you can close your eyes or you can keep your eyes open. If you've never tapped before, you may want to just watch me um, so that you can kind of let me be your guide. I'm gonna talk you through it. So as we do this together more, you're not going to need to watch me because sometimes I'm not so pretty to be looking at. <laughs> so take a 
moment to come on into your space. Take a time to find the crown of your head and just uh, take a moment to gently tap your fingertips on the very crown of your head. So as you're tapping, you can switch hands. You don't always have to be on the same hand. And then you just tap for as long as it feels good to you on that space. If that space doesn't feel good to you, then you just skip that space. There's really no right or wrong way to do this. The next space uh, for my yogis out there, this is the third eye space. But if you don't know what that is, you're going to take a moment to tap right in the center of your head with your middle finger. And you're going to tap your forefinger and your ring finger right gently above your eyebrows. So take a moment to find that. So the next thing you wanna do is go right below your side of the eyes, right above the cheekbone, kind of below the temple. And if you tap, I mean, if you rated your issue over five, then I would encourage you to do both hands. If you only have access to one, say you're driving and you're nervous about traffic or something like that, you can tap with I mean, just with one hand, okay? So I'm going to, for the sake of teaching you this, to tap right below the eyes. The next thing you're gonna go is the sinus cavities. And the more we tap together each Tuesday, then I'm gonna be teaching you about some of these meridians that you're actually tapping into and what that goes to because I'm such a mind, body, spirit person. The next thing that I want you to go to is right on your upper lip, below your nose. Again, don't forget, you can switch hands. This can be about on your upper lip right here. Next one is below the chin, or on the chin, below your lip. Take some time to just tap right there. So you're tapping to feel it. You're not tapping to bruise yourself. So I don't want any damages. No self-injury behaviors here today. You're talking to a therapist. Okay, the next thing is I want you to tap. This one can kind of be kind of hard to find. So if you go to your collarbone and just gently kind of walk down until you feel this little puffy part, this is called the sore spot and it's called that because it kind of can be sore when you tap that. So if you don't like tapping, you can always massage that area, okay? But I like tapping. I feel like it's the energy juices flowing. And then you're gonna go to the heart space. So for that one, I just kind of punch right in the center of my chest. And then the next one, you're gonna go kind of underneath your ribs. So kind of pick them up, girls, picking up the puppies. <laughs> Boys, forgive me. Okay, so tapping right there. You're going to go to the, this is called the karate chop. You're going to go from the pinky to the wrist area. Right here is called the karate chop. So that's what you go right up underneath. You just kind of relax your shoulders. Okay, so that is the short basic recipe. So now that you've done that, you should just take a breath in. And as you exhale... Take a moment to see what do you notice. Sometimes the issue gets a little stronger and sometimes it gets, you know, you kind of rate it down. But if you feel like your score might have went up or you're not quite, you know, there yet, then I want you to keep tapping. You can replay the video. Now, when we come back together next Tuesday, I'm going to have a specific tapping message for you. So if you um, want to reach out to me, if there's something that you're personally dealing with and you would like for me to bring something into my tapping sessions with you on Tuesdays, let me know. It can be a word, a phrase, an issue. Maybe you're dealing with some kind of chronic pain. Um, maybe you've got a big interview coming up, and if I can time it correctly, I will certainly do my best to incorporate that into our Tuesday Tapping Series. Um, I have had to change my website. I had a domain issue, and so you can now find me at drangieanderson.com, drangieanderson.com. It's still the serenity for now. Um, so I do want you to uh, go there, and if you would be so kind, subscribe to my website because that's how I'm mostly going to be announcing retreats and things like that. 
Um, so go check me out there. I've got some tapping series on my YouTube video at Dr. Angie Anderson. Um, I think you can also find those same videos on my website. I'll put that in the comments afterwards and you can always follow me here. But here at Serenity Counseling Center, Facebook is where I'm gonna be doing the Tuesday series for the tapping. So I do invite you to join me. I don't know what time, I've got a very complicated schedule, but I am gonna to try to make it happen on Tuesdays. So again, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. Don't forget that um, it doesn't cure the problem, but it will certainly help you regulate that. Um, whatever it is that you're dealing with and help you be in a little bit more logical space to be able to deal with that. Uh, so I hope everyone stays healthy, stay well. I look forward to seeing you next Tuesday. As always, namaste and happy tapping.